Hi, and welcome to Data Explorer's video update for week commencing October the 19th. My name is Ruby McCormack. First, let's take a look at the market overview. The Desley Global 50, which tracks to change insure interest for the 50 largest global companies, finished the week unchanged from last week at 76. The UK was up 8%, Europe 7%, and the US 4%. Japan was down 17%, and Asia 12%. Equity markets ended the week on a disappointing low following a mixed week and the market's response to the stream of corporate earnings announcements over the week. Commodities held steady with the exception of gold, which has been weaker following its recent strong run. Now look at the upcoming earnings and economic announcements. Economic announcements this week in the U.S. will include producer price and housing market figures. There will be close focus on housing starts as a leading indicator for construction industry. In the U.S., we expect earnings results from Bolt Technology, CSS Industries, and Diax. Bolt's technology has seen its short base fall from 8% to 5%. CSS Industries has seen a gradual increase in its short base and currently stands at 2%. The short base for Diax is falling and is currently at 3%. In Europe, we anticipate no mo- major economic announcements. We expect earnings announcements from Danka Business Systems, St. Ives, and Bremer Shipping Services. We also expect management statements from Sinwald Group and William Hill. In Asia, we anticipate no major earnings announcements. That's the news for today. For more information, please go to our website at www.dataexplorers.com. For detailed short base information on some of the stocks mentioned here today, or any other stocks that have seen unusual shorting activity, please subscribe to our daily reports and research service at www.dataexplorers.com forward slash e-mail. Thanks for listening and have a great day.